Let's go back to the high jump now. This is Hollis Conway, his second attempt, going after 7-9 and three quarters. They call him the spud web of high jumping. You know, most high jumpers are six feet five, six feet six. He's only six feet one quarter of an inch. This is 21 and a half inches over his head. A new American record. The junior from Shreveport has literally burst onto the international scene in one year. Two years ago, he finished fifth in the NCAAs. You remember the problem he had on his last jump, stalling out at the top. Here he gets tremendous lift, touches it with his uniform on the way up, but he must be two or three inches over there. How high can he go? Well, he's been talking about eight feet all week long. That would be the world record. Back over in the high jump, Hollis Conway has had the bar put at eight feet. He missed twice at seven, ten and a half. This would be a new world record. Almost two feet over his head. He calls eight feet an important psychological barrier. The first Olympian ever for southwestern Louisiana. Again, the world record, seven, eleven and a half. Oh, and nowhere close. You know, he's been out there jumping for three hours. You get a little tired after all that time. But he said he wanted to come here and try eight feet. And he sets the American record and wins the NCAA championship. A real popular guy among the other jumpers. He's always loose, jumps rope before his jumps, always encourages the other guys. You can see here, a little tired, took off again a little too far away, and really wasn't even close. Irv Cross is with him. The happiest man on the track right now, of course, in the field events, uh, Hollis Conway with an American record, seven, nine and three quarters. We're standing on the bar here, Hollis. Can you reach that? That's eight feet. That's where he went out. But yeah, how tall are you anyway? I'm six feet, one quarter of an inch. Six, one, you jump seven, nine and three quarters. Yeah. You know, how do you do it? I don't know. I, I thank God. It's God-given talent, you know, and I work hard, you know, and I just thank God for it. Well, I noticed in those later jumps that your coaches were over there trying to give you some pointers. What were they telling you? Yeah, well, they were telling me I was a little slow off the back because I tend to get a little lazy and cruise in, and uh, it was causing me to be a little too far out, so I needed to pick it up. Do you ever have any dreams of making eight feet one day? Oh, all the time, you know, and that's why today I just want to take one temp attempt at it. I think I could have made 17, but I want to take one jump at eight feet. 17 you could have made, but eight feet, what the heck, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, well, congratulations. Let's take a look at this one more time. Reach up there. Eight feet, that's where you want to go for the world record. Seven, nine, and three quarters is a record he made today for a new American record. Congratulations.